number of hashtags that you deemed were negative towards Ms. Hurd. That's right? Yes. Yeah. And the, the four you picked, at least the negative ones, uh, Justice for Johnny Depp, that's one of them, right? That's right. Amber Heard is an abuser. That's one of them. That is one of them. We just don't like you, Amber. That's one of them. That is one of them. And the last one was Amber Turd, right? That is, an, that is another one. Okay. Um, and these four hashtags you identified and searched for, you have no, you don't believe they have any connection, or you testify that there, you have no connection to these three Waldman statements. The hashtags aren't, aren't connected to Waldman, right? Well, I did an additional analysis that did show how many of those had Waldman connected to them, and I found that one out of four of them did. Right. But when you were deposed, you were asked whether, whether these were related, these particular hashtags were related to any of the Waldman statements, and, and you said no at that time. I said more than that. I, I did. I said I, I said I didn't know, and then and then I said um, I'm basing my. Uh, I, I'm looking at Mr. Banya's opinion, where he says they would be if they were in large number, and I'm, I'm adopting his opinion and agreeing with him that they must be connected. So, so you're adopting an opinion that hasn't been rendered in this case yet by anybody but you. Well, I know that Mr. Banya has testified. Okay, uh, what I'm saying is I know that Mr. Banya, Mr. Banya's disclosure says that he is expected to come to that opinion. All right, but the only person who's ever expressed this opinion today in this courtroom is you, correct? I, w I wouldn't, I haven't watched everything, I've watched a bit. So, but... you're, you're adopting your own opinion? Um, no, I'm adopting the opinion that I read in Mr. Banya's disclosure. Right. And that's not the opinion you had during your deposition? I think I did make reference in my deposition to uh, what Mr. Banya said and, and that I agreed with it. All right. And you indicated in deposition you didn't take into account statements made in the media, correct? Made in what? I couldn't use you, you said you did, you did not take into account in your analysis statements made in the media. Media. Um, yes, in the analysis where I gathered data and decided which data to gather, I did not take into account statements in the media. All right. You, so you looked at data, you produced charts, you did analysis relating to the data, but you had no reason at the time you did this to consider any particular statements. Isn't that true? That's true. I think that's a, a, an appropriate scientific methodology to not uh, to first get, gather as much data as possible and then drill down on the data. All right. And the Twitter data you collected shows that the four hashtags you would you identified were in existence before Mr. Waldman made the first statement in April 2020, right? That's correct. Right. In very small number. But, but justice for Johnny Depp has been around since 2013, correct? Um, that sounds correct. Yeah. Amber Heard is an abuser, and Amber Turd first appeared in 2016, correct? I don't recall, actually. Right. Do you recall if there was any portion of Mr. Waldman's statement that made any reference to Amber Turd? Not that I've seen. Right. Uh, people can form a negative view of Ms. Heard without reading Mr. Waldman's statements, correct? People can form a negative opinion of anyone without reading anything, that's correct. And you didn't consider whether there was negative publicity around Ms. Heard other than the Waldman statements? Well, my, what I did was to report on uh, correlation uh, with with these hashtags and certain search terms in particular. I wasn't trying to read anyone's mind as to why they used them. You didn't form any opinion that of, of the million tweets, million plus tweets that you looked at, 